I absolutely would not have a pond without the fish. We always have had fish from day one. I, I can go out to that pond and stare at those fish for an hour. I know that sounds goofy, but it's a de-stressor. And it's just watching them swim around and the movements. Every single fish is named, every single one. Biggest one, the very first one that we had put in there is Dreamsicle. Hot tamale. He named them Hoover, Auric, and Eureka. Obviously after the vacuum cleaners, because when you feed them, they come up and they're sucking away. And it's like, oh, we've got Midnight. We have a black koi, jet black, so he's Midnight. And I have Silky. She's a white, um, leather-sided koi. And uh, we do have a, a blue koi, supposed, supposedly rare. You become uh, a friend to your fish, and you want to feed them every day. I look yeah, she forward rushes, to she it. Yeah, she rushes home every day to feed the fish. I get home, she's like, all right, I already fed them. Don't feed them anymore. <laughs> They're beautiful. Some are just gorgeous. The kids love them. They love to feed them. Fish come right up and eat it right out of your hand. Algae tends to build up. It's normal, OK? My, I don't have any algae in my pond at all, you know, the green, stringy stuff, because my fish eat it all. And the fish will eat off of everything that's in the pond. They don't need the fish food. Oh, but I think they do. <laughs> <laughs> we travel a lot, and you didn't actually right. don't have to worry about people coming over and feeding them. They just kind of do their own thing. They eat the, you know, some of the algae and stuff that may grow into the pond. The ponds stay very clear, so they're pretty much a perfect pet. You don't have to do anything with the fish. I mean, the, the fish stay in there year round. You don't. You know, everybody says, well, "What do you do with the fish in the winter?" Nothing. They stay in the pond. That's the neat thing. You know, they, you don't have to do anything to the fish. Don't they feed them. They hibernate like bears. Yeah, don't feed them. They go to the, on the bottom they of the pond, the they bottom, hang, hang make out. Make sure they have a little air hole, and they're happy. You put a bubbler in, or you have the option of letting your waterfall run all winter long. We just have to be careful at the bottom of the waterfall to make sure the ice doesn't form at that one section so that the water can continue to flow underneath. And then spring, they all file. <laughs> the ice melts. And boom, the fish are there. Temperature goes above 55. And they're happy to see you when you have a little food in April for them. And they're bigger. They and grow. <laughs> well, I'm excited to be able to see the fish because of the, the system that Aquascapes gives to us you know, really clears the water. We don't have any problems with brown or green water. Everything's nice and clear.